Hey guys. Okay. I'm like genuinely excited to show you how to do this because I actually think it's really cool. So <laughs> we're going to do it. Um, I'm also going to link some other videos for some other repeating fraction or sorry, decimal action, uh, that to turn into fractions. Okay. So I'll link those. All right, but let's go ahead and get started with this one. So it says convert 0.33 with a line over it to a fraction. If you don't know, um, the line over the 0.33 um, means that the threes keep repeating forever. When I say forever, I really mean that. 0 0.33333 forever. So obviously we can't write that out. So they put that little line over it. Okay. Now this can be converted to a fraction. Okay. But our normal trick of being able to do that doesn't work with this because it goes on forever, right? So we have a different way of doing it, okay? So what we're gonna do first is we're going to set our number here equal to a variable. So we're gonna do x equals 0 0.33 repeating, okay? Next, what I'm going to do, hang with me, okay? What I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply both sides by 10. Okay. So I'm going to multiply this side by 10. Don't switch videos. Hang with me. It, it should make sense. Okay. I'm multiplying both sides by 10. Why can I do that? Because as long as I multiply both sides, it stays even. Okay. If I do it to one side, I got to do it to the other. Okay. So watch what happens when I do that. This side has 10 X equals when I multiply this by 10 it just moves this decimal place to the right one okay so it'll be 10x equals 3.33 repeating okay so you might be like why why did she just do that why can we do that okay it is legal in math land all right to multiply both things by the same number right on both sides and this is going to help us get to our answer okay so everything we've done is legal and it's going to help us get to our answer so the next thing we're going to do okay is we're going to subtract x from both sides okay so i'm subtracting x from this side and i'm subtracting x from this side but if you remember from the very beginning Jen. guys my alexa is talking <laughs> alexa stop all right I'm subtracting X from both sides. But if you remember from when we started, what did we say X was? X is 0 0.33 repeating, right? So I'm writing it as X on this side. I'm actually going to write it as 0 0.33 repeating on this side. But it's the same thing, okay? You staying with me? All right. So 10X minus X is... 9x, right? 10x is take away 1x gives me 9x, okay? If I subtract the 0.3 repeating from this side, that gets rid of these, right? And I'm just left with 3. Oh my gosh, this is like I can do this, right? Our whole goal is to get that x alone. So this is 9 times x. To undo that, I'm going to divide by 9 on both sides, okay? Those um, go away. So I'm left with X equals three ninths, which, uh, simplifies down to one third. Okay. What? Now, if you don't believe me, go plug one third into your calculator. It'll probably round it for you, but it'll be probably say 0 0.3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, And obviously it can't go on forever, but you get the idea. Okay. All right. I hope that made sense. Um, I have some other examples on other videos um, where it's like a point the, these two numbers are different, but they repeat. And when there's one here, go check those out if you need to. Uh, but hopefully that made sense and you can get your homework done.